Hey, this is Alan. I'm here to set the record straight. Macro photography is not insect photography. It's more than that. So this video is to set the record straight so that the next time you hear somebody described as a macro photographer, you'll have a better idea about the kind of things that they photograph. Now, complicated matters, I am actually a self-confessed insect photographer as well as a macro photographer. So sit back, relax, have a nice cup of tea while I explain to you the difference between a macro photographer and an insect photographer. It is true that I have photographed ant lions and beetles and crickets and some dragonflies. But in the same time, I've also photographed alligators, alkaline AA batteries, alcohol, aster, nemoralis, an ass, antiques, art, an AC motor, agkistrodon piscivorous, autonomous articulating arm assembly, aluminium extrusion, and Dropagon Gerardi. Astronauts, artificial limbs. I photographed bark, berries, bracelets, bird boxes, blowers, bolites, bulbs, barnacles, a boardwalk, and briefs. I've snapped the occasional camera, some coffee, computer chips, chimps, crayons, chameleons, cash, coleopsis, and coins. I've also photographed droplets, darts, ducklings, drafting instruments, disinfectant, diopters. If you look through my Lightroom, you'll see that I've also photographed earwigs, fire ants, gall wasps, harvestmen, and ichneumons. But I've also photographed elephants, extension tubes, electronics, eyepieces, evil cats, earrings, engravings, fenders, Furnaces, fiddler crabs, factories, flappers, filters, flower beds, fungi, and, I guess, flamingi. I photographed glass, geckos, glades, graves, gulls, glasses, geese, grinders, gravel, grime, and golf balls. The golf balls was fun. I photographed hose pipes, hurricane aftermath, haunted houses, Hoods, hands, hyacinths. I've also taken the occasional snap of some ink pens, infinity corrected optics, inkjet printer heads, incandescent lights, initials, ice cream, and innards. So among the bugs that I have shot are Jerusalem crickets, which I hate, katydids, which I love, leaf rolling atalabidae, mason bees, Neuroptera, including owl flies. But I've also shot jets, junk, jewelry, jelly beans, and a guy named Jim. I have pictures of knots, knives, kit lenses, knurling, KNF tripods, lots of them, kicks, knobs, kitchen utensils, lipstick, LEDs, Lizards, lilies, lovebirds, lighthouses, light posts, lenses, lichen, moons, mallards, medicine cabinets, milk, models, microscope, macro rails, minerals, marigolds, and minestrone, nibs, nests, nikons, nickors, nutritional supplements, needlework, nasturtiums, nuts, needles, oranges, onions, Oranions, opals, objectives, owls, ointments, oils, operating tables. Looking at my bug pictures, you will see a pleasing fungus beetle, but you won't see Queen Alexandra's birdwing. That's because it's the largest butterfly in the world, and I've never seen one, and it's kind of pushing the limits of macro. I've got rove beetles, springtails, termites, pickers, potions, pussies, perfumers, pigeons, pets, paint, paracord, pines, plastic plants, pennies, and pincers. I've taken pictures of quick-release clamps, quartz lamps, queens, quicksilver, 
and quilts. I photographed resin, roses, reptiles of all kinds, rivers, rocks, reversing rings, remotes, robots, robins. I have pictures of sparrows, spheres, signs, swallows, sunsets, straps, swamps, splashes, soap, and slime molds, and even a collection of surgical scrimshaw. Did you know that that was a thing? It is, and I have photographs of it. I have pictures of turtles, tweezers, trestles, tunnels, turns, taps, thorns, toys, teeth, toads. I have a picture of a thing called the unique headed bug. It's also known as the gnat bug. I've got vinegar flies, warble flies, uh, I don't have a Ziri's blue butterfly because it went extinct before I could photograph it, but I have a yucca moth and a zebra swallowtail. But in addition to those, I have photographs of unknown symbols, unfocused lights, what appears to be UV-itis, upside down, umbrellas, an UNO, UV light sources, ulcer medicine, and an udder. I have pictures of veterans, video lights, Velcro, veins, violets, variable ND filters, vires. You'll also find wildflowers, whistling ducks, wire, water, walkways, windows, warnings, webs, wings, and a wabbit. I've taken pictures of an XT2, xenon flash tubes, exacto knives, cross polarizers and Christmas ornaments. And if you were a macro photographer, you could also photograph yachts, yourself, the color yellow, yashikas, yakitori. You can also take pictures of Xena diodes, a Zoom H5, a Zabaglione, zippers, or a zygoma. I didn't show a single picture of an insect today. I told you about some of the insects that I photographed, but I didn't show you any. That's because I was trying to reinforce the point that, yeah, I'm a bug photographer, but I also photograph other things. So if you'd like to learn how to photograph bugs or literally anything else, then come over to Patreon, because that's where I live. And that's what I do, is teach people how to take pictures of things that are smaller than, say, the Empire State Building. And if you come over there, I'll teach you how to take pictures of all of those things, except the artificial limb, because it's gone. And I don't know where it's gone. I don't know how you can lose something like that. But I have. If you find it, please return it. Thank you. I hope to see you over on Patreon. Till then, take care, stay safe, and be well. Yeah.